you in this instant? My boy was. Delicious fellow. I invited you to spend the night. Oh, splendid. Jenny, this is Lancelot Dulac. No. Your Majesty, this is the Lancelot no one spoke of. He's come all the way from France just to become a knight at the round table. Welcome, Lord. I hope your journey was pleasant. I'm honored, Your Majesty. And allow me to pray, Your Majesty, my eternal dedication to the fire cause. Thank you, Lord. How charming of you to join us, Archie. This wonderful dream must be made a universal reality. Oh, absolutely. It's really love. Can you speak for my job we're having? I have assured His Majesty that he may call upon me any time to perform anything, no matter the risk. Thank you, Lord. That's the most comforting. Can you speak for my job? I'm always on duty. <laughs> Yes, I can see that. <laughs> can you stay out there? With pleasure, my love. I want you to hear the new plan we've been discussing. Explain it, my philosophy. To Her Majesty's plan? Would Her Majesty not find the complicated affairs of chivalry rather tedious? Not at all, my lord. I've never found chivalry tedious. So far. <laughs> May I remind you, my lord, that the round table happens to be my husband's idea. Any idea, however, itself is can be improved. Really? Yes, I suggested to his majesty that he create a training program for tonight. Marvelous idea, isn't it? A training program? Yes, it's a program for training. <laughs> yes, your majesty, there must be a standard established. An unattainable goal that, with work, becomes attainable. Not only in arms, but in thought. An indoctrination of the noble Christian principle. And whose abilities would serve as standard, my lord? Certainly not mine, Your Majesty. It would not be fair. Not fair in what way? I would not ask anyone to live by my standards, Your Majesty. To dedicate one's life to the tortured quest for perfection in body and spirit. Oh, no, Your Majesty, I would not ask that of any. No, would I. <laughs> Have you achieved perfection, my lord? Physically, yes, your majesty. But the refining of the soul of an endless struggle. I dare say, I do dare say. And you mean you've never been defeated in battle or in tournament? Never, your majesty. I see. And I gather you consider it highly unlikely ever to happen in the future. Highly, your majesty. How is the channel? Did you ever rub crossing? Now tell me a little of your struggle for the perfection of the spirit. But I want you to hear about the training program. I'd much rather hear about his spirit and his noble Christian principles. Tell me, my lord, have you come to grips with humility lately, my lord? Humility, your majesty? I think we'd better discuss the training program elsewhere. Not here. And not now. You look far too beautiful, my dearest, to have anything on your mind but frolic and flowers. Have a lovely day. And to all of you, come last quickly.